Hi, I'm Christina. And I'm Tom. And welcome to Movies in Minutes. We are reviewing Abominable. Which I could have sworn had an, originally had a different name of Everest, the movie. Everest the movie Everest. sounds like that would be a documentary. So Abominable, so it starts off with a monster. Escaping. Ye Yeti-esque. Yeti call it a Yeti. Yeah, Yeti-esque. Escapes a facility and encounters a Yi. Yi. A young grieving child. Yes. Well. She, yeah, she's, she's getting over the loss of yeah, her dad. Yeah, and she's like 12-ish. Yes. Um, and I, the voice is Chloe Bennett from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. All of their voice actors have some a Asian descendants, which yes. I thought was uh, good, authentic voices. Yes. I love um, the, the grandma. grandma. <laughs> yes. The grandma. It's grandma she... in her tracksuit with her butterfly clip. Yes. Should have dressed and like her, that. Today. And her, her pearls of wisdom that she dropped here and there, I thought it's was. Summer. I thought it was hilarious. Not time to be busy. <laughs> um, it's really good. Uh, it's now one of my kids' favorite movies. We've. We currently have the Glen Ellen copy checked out, and we've watched mm. it at least two times, and all the special features, and the kids watch all this. It has a mix of it has everything I like. It's it's a different culture, so this is a Chinese culture. Well researched, different. Yes, culture. and you see the emphasis on family and friendship and, and music. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Learn to play a musical instrument. I uh, think I think I think it helps. My five year old's like, can you teach me violin after watching that? Yeah, so. and also we've got plenty. Of books at the library like if you're curious like I don't know how this instrument works yeah. like learn the history of it and also there is sheet music that is going to be in some of our books we have so many plugins with music at the library in general I know we have some music kits coming out eventually yeah at some point but um, I, the one thing at the beginning of the movie is when Yi was playing the, the instrument like in secret and she's like yo yo ma level good I'm just like unrealistic that she's just like oh I my dad played. I don't really play. And I'm just like, okay, concerto number nine. Have <laughs> have more faith in your yeah in your in your playing ability. Yeah, play ability. Also, fun fact that I learned from watching all this. So I watched all the special features and additional things because I could have sworn uh -huh. the Yeti Everest when he was humming and when he was humming, he had magical uh -huh. powers. It sounded straight up like a bass or a cello. Oh, but it was... It, I mean, it wasn't. It, it was an auto-tune grumble bo man. And IMDb, I mean, he, he there is someone listed, but his voice was auto-tuned? Yes. For this, that makes yes, sense. Yes, which they have a craft of how to make a magical vase wow. to make your own voice sound. Yet it, the special features are worth are worth watching okay. with your kids, even. Okay. Um, but, yeah, so I could have sworn that was in there, but it, it wasn't ever. But, but I, I liked it. Eddie Izzard. Does the voice of the yes. old guy? Yeah, he's he's good. Yes. Yeah. Um, but I enjoyed it. I thought it was I thought it was beautiful. It was cute. It's not annoying to watch twice in one week. <laughs> no, and I watched it twice in about two and a half weeks. Yeah. Yeah. So it's not annoying to watch. So you for clearly adults. replayability. And the kids love it. It's yeah. it's just because the yeti is essentially a child yeti. So. Mm -hmm. They're like punching each other, like punching themselves. No, they're having fun. Like, yeah, yeah, no, nothing super dark, mm -hmm. uh, action-wise. No. Words like they talked about like get the yeti dead or alive, but that's as far as it went for bad. for bad content with kids. Mm -hmm. My kids, both my two-year-old and my five-year-old, loved this movie, laughing so hard. High star review from us. High praise. So thank you for checking it out at the library. Oh, see you next time. Yeah, I enjoyed it.